What's up everybody, this is Never Jinx and we're about to take a trip to Paris. That's right, this is the third part of my in-depth analysis of Modern Warfare 3 and all the trailers that go along with it. Up first, uh, we're just going to show the beginning of the clip. You'll see that we have a US soldier flying into Paris, the Eiffel Tower. He's wearing a gas mask um, and that's the drop-off point down there. You can see the um, helicopter slightly lowering as the film drops off. O-pos means O-positive, that's the soldier's blood type. Um, once again, more confirmation of gas and gas mask in the game. Uh, and a few dead sh soldiers there to the left and also one in the beginning of the clip. This is the most revealing part of the France trailer. Because as you can see here, it shows a type of flat jacket, uh, maybe riot shield type material. Um an armored vehicle, more gas, and this is very precarious because that was a, some type of incendiary grenade. Uh, this shows the explosion physics and some type of launcher with gas in the mask again. Apparently France is getting gassed. Uh, this is a mounted police vehicle in some sort of chase scene, probably through the campaign. It means a police armored vehicle in an American. This is the same soldier as we've seen previously. He has the same patch with the same tear. And this is really exciting. That is a FAMAS and that is possibly an MP5 silence with an enemy in the background and smoke grenades on his waist. And the last clip wasn't very revealing. It's just an enemy vehicle, an enemy heli, possibly a chase scene. But that's about it guys. Part 4 is going to be coming out soon. That will be Germany. Until then, I'll talk to you later.